What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Um, today we're just going to, um, we're going to look for another, uh, insanely cheap cell phone, um, on eBay. I don't know if any of you people remember the cheapest $8 smartphone video I found, or I made, of a phone I found on eBay. We're going to try to do a part two of that. So, let's get started. So, you might be wondering how I find um, uh, things on eBay as cheap as I do, especially for the cell phones. So, this will also help you see that. So, we're just going to do, well, let's first start with iPhones, okay? Because iPhones are even better. And I just wrote iPhones because I am dumb. We don't want we don't want multiple iPhones. I want a singular iPhone. Okay, so always go buy it now. And then best match, we're gonna do uh, price plus shipping lowest first. And here we go. We're going to look to see. So there's an iPhone four for ten dollars already. There's a 5S. Let's let, let's see what's going on here. I already have two 5S's, but it's a Verizon one. Okay, does look like it kind of works. Not too sure here. Apple iPhone 5S. Condition this part. Oh, iCloud lock. See? You never want to buy an iPhone with iCloud lock because it's almost impossible to remove it unless you're the person who owns the account that it's iCloud locked to under. Very, very annoying. Um, nice, Apple iPhone 4. <laughs> um, not seeing too many good iPhones here, guys, to be honest. Some of these things get so smashed. Look at that. Oh, so this one's actually somewhat desirable because that's iOS 6 right there. And does that say? Oh, never mind. I thought that was an iPhone 4. This is a 3GS. They can't just write iPhone 3GS. They have to do iPhone A1303. Whatever. Let's go back here. Is this really the cheapest we have for iPhones? What category am I in? I want to be in all. Yeah, this is what we want. Okay. The absolute cheapest thing, 75 cents. Okay. Um, I want to see if there's a way to remove China results, though, because we're going to... You know what I'll just do? I'll just do um, uh, $1 to $100. There we go. So, search filters are your friend. <laughs> Check lock, clean loss, buy IMEI, just iPhone, free local pickup. All right. Again, so much of this stuff. And now we're getting the sponsored ads here. That's what happens when you go to the all category. Okie doke. Here we go. Now we're actually getting somewhere. I was able to filter all of this. And see what we can get here. New listing. iPhone 7 headphone adapter. Alright. Let's see here. Got some batteries box only. I actually used to buy those. Oh man, it's a housing. Okay, I don't want cases, guys. See, you have to sort through so much garbage to actually find something good here. Okay, see what I mean? Here's something. Like, we wouldn't have seen this on the other listing. This is a 4S what you see is what you get is the condition that does not sound promising and that is all they're gonna say about that um, 
iPhone 5S 1649 for parts. What is wrong with you, Mr. iPhone 5S? Why? Huh? Oh, there's two phones. Either gold, silver. Some have some power on, some have on cloud, some have pests. Okay. That is what the issue is. We are going to keep searching through all of this garbage. Sorry guys, Bandicam freaking cut me off at a 10 minute cap. So that's just what happened. We're just still sifting through all of this garbage here. Uh, rear panel. Oh, wow. Okay, here we go. iPhone 4, white, 8 gig, Verizon, $8. For parts are not working. Looks like it's in good condition, actually. I bet it's passcode locked. Um, condition iCloud locked bad ESN. Um... So this is a, a a tricky tricky situation because um, you don't quite know what you're gonna get with Apple when you get iCloud locked things. Um, I would. This is tough. This person doesn't have very good feedback either. I'm gonna pass on this one. Um, as much as good of a deal as that is, I mean that thing worth in parts is worth more than that but that's not the goal of this challenge the goal of this challenge is to find the cheapest functioning phone or iPhone so we're gonna keep going what do we have here oh well this is a sponsored thing iPhone for what twenty five dollars for all of this? Four S white unlock. Well, okay, that is not an iPhone four, dude. Just saying. There is literally so much garbage in here. I found 4S. What do we have here? Small crack. The f the f this phone might work. Might. Not this phone doesn't work. This phone works. Condition uncertain. This phone might work. Oh, that's hilarious. Alright. I'm going to give up on iPhones. Let's just go to regular phones now. Okay. Alright. Bye now. I might actually stay in cell phones this time just because of all the junk that was in the last listing field. Oh, here we go. Hashtag YOLO. iPhone 3G. Black. Four dollars. Fast and free shipping. Four dollars. That's less than like getting a Big Mac or something like that. Um, power button is not working, please. Yeah, this is, this is totally plausible. I might throw this guy in the cart here. We're selling as is. Wow. Four dollars. Like, it costs more than that to ship the thing. It, so the way these things work is in order to um, get to the home screen, you have to have an AT&T SIM card. 
I've done that several times before. Um, unless it needs to be jailbroken, that's also something you can do. So let's add this one to the cart. We'll, we'll, we'll keep looking. It's just that's an incredible price. All right. Okay, so there's actually several of these. Several. Look. All of these iPhones. All of them are $4. And they all are the same thing. Uh, condition is used, sold as is, cracked. Oof. That one's worth $2. Oh, this one's four. This one's four thirty, four sixty. What? What makes this one worth the extra sixty cents? You might wonder. Is it in impeccable condition? Oh, it's cracked on the back. It looks like. Um. Does show signs of having use. Well, what was so great about the one that I just found? Like, this one looked like it was actually in good condition. Screen's not cracked. Yeah. I mean, free shipping, fast and free even for $4 for an iPhone? Yes. Yes, please. We will we will buy that. Um All right. Now we're going to we're just going to look for um an Android phone here. Just to see what we can get from Android. I already have um I think I have two iPhone 3G's I I know one, at least I have one that works oh this one's five dollars Galaxy S6 Edge box alright Verizon LG phone alright guys here we go four dollar iPhone free shipping boom and that is how you find cheap phones on eBay. So now the fun part's going to be, and look, just going to show you here. Thanks, your order is placed. Estimated delivery Friday, September 20th. We'll send you an email. All right, whatever. I'll check back in with you, th with you guys when this is delivered. Thanks for watching. All right, you guys, and just a couple of days later, faster than expected, we have received our $4 iPhone. And I am very excited to go ahead and check this out. So let's go ahead and tear into this little package. It came in here, and we will be able to see what we're working with. Thank you for your business and choosing our company for your products. Okay. Um, it's in relatively okay condition. Part of the SIM tray is broken. It's an 8 gig one and it's missing two of the pentalobe screws down there. Oh. And it is actually already on there, making this even easier for us. Okay, so, one thing is, when you get an iPhone like this, alright, one of these old iPhones, I believe anything before the 3GS, um, you're going to have to go through the process of activating the phone with iTunes, okay? So it says, no SIM card installed, please insert a valid SIM card with no SIM lock to activate this iPhone. Um, and then it gives you the IMEI number, EICCID, and you can slide for emergency call. So, um, luckily for me, I do have, since I've been doing this for a while, I've collected a box 
of just various different SIM cards from different carriers. So I have SIM cards for most of the major carriers in the U.S., more for some, uh, less for others. So I got AT&T, I got Sprint, I have T-Mobile, I don't think I actually have Verizon. But this here is going to be your golden ticket to getting this thing going. You need a full-size AT&T SIM card. Um, which, if you go down to the AT&T store and say, hey man, I need help just getting this unlocked, they'll usually be fine with actually just handing one of these cards to you, no problem. So, um, it's not that hard to do, actually, but it can be frustrating. So, I do have my computer over here off to the side, and what you're going to need to do is you're going to have to use iTunes, um, in order to activate the phone. So let me show you what that looks like. Alright, so here we are. Got a little split, split screen action going here. iTunes is open. Going to go ahead and see if I can pop that tray. Oh yeah, no problem. Um, and then we take this big thing here and you plug that in. And then it just... It only goes one way, so be gentle. You slide it in, and uh... okay. So iTunes is going to go ahead and try to initialize the phone here. It says verify an iPhone. And now the phone's telling us that a sync's in progress, and... There we go. Nice. And then you can just go on from there, no big deal, um, and use your phone like normal. Um, and it has decided to start syncing uh, with this, which is fine, but you also don't have to do that. Alright, let's get on to the next step. Alright you guys, so here you go. You have a functional iPhone. A very old, granted, functional iPhone that is on iOS version 4.2.1. But, and the power button doesn't work, but it still is an iPhone. As you can see, let's see if the camera works. Let's take a little picture here. As you can see here, oh, look at that glorious quality. No pinch to zoom or anything. This is what your camera app was. There was no video, no autofocus, no tap to focus, no iOS, or anything like that. But, I mean, this actually can be a viable option for some people. Like, if you just want something that you can throw MP3s onto, plug a pair of headphones in and listen to music, that's something that you can totally do with this. And this was only four bucks, all right? And it works. As you can see here, we have the classic, classic ringtones. You know, all this good stuff. This is one of the better condition 3Gs that I've found.